Hey guys, it's Timmy and this is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. So today, today is the day that All Elite Wrestling's All Out tickets do go on sale. It is Cody and the Young Bucks' big return to the Sears Center, the home of All In. Now with that, I have to preface that this video is being recorded 20 minutes after the tickets did go on sale. At the 20 minute mark, there were over 60,000 people in the queue to order tickets. But that's not the reason for this video. The reason for this video is because with ordering tickets, when you get in the queue, it says you have 10 minutes to order your tickets and it's only four per person. Well, the most expensive ticket for All Elite Wrestling that you can get that's not a VIP ticket is $190. The cheapest is $30 and these tickets are already being sold on the second market, are already being sold on StubHub. People got in early enough that they got tickets to All Out and they have already uploaded and trying to sell them on StubHub before others have even been able to purchase their tickets. And again, this is 20 minutes. This video is being recorded 20 minutes after tickets did go on sale and we have not heard word yet from All Elite Wrestling if they have sold out. But, but listen to these numbers. As of 9.20 Pacific time, there were at least... 200 tickets on StubHub for All Out. The most expensive ticket that you could have bought by yourself was $160. These tickets are now going for $1,850, 12 times what you would have paid if you got these tickets through the Sears Center box office website. The cheapest tickets on StubHub, if you would have bought them from the Sears Center box office, are in the $30 to $60 range, and those are going anywhere from $150 to $250, four to five times their actual base value. And with these $1,800 tickets, those aren't even ringside tickets. Those are, let me pull up StubHub for you right here. Those are section 102 and 101. So people are already mad. People are already upset online that they're in queue. There are 30, 40, 50,000 people ahead of them in queue. And people are already selling these tickets for upwards of 12 times their base value. So this just tells us that, hey, people saw the opportunity here. I'm not saying that this is a good thing. I'm saying that the scalpers, scalpers going to scalp. Secondhand dealers are going to secondhand deal. But this is ridiculous. Very very ridiculous when you're selling tickets at 12 times market value 12 times a hundred and sixty dollar seat that you, if you would have got into the queue this morning and got your tickets through the AEW ticks website the Sears Center box office you would have only had to spend hundred and sixty dollars so this is ridiculous we will continue to monitor this situation and see how many more tickets throughout the day do go up on StubHub or Vivid Seats or any of these other secondhand websites and see exactly how high people are trying to sell them for but that's gonna do it for this episode of Pro Wrestling Unlimited remember to comment below like and share this video like us on Facebook Instagram and Twitter subscribe here on YouTube and follow pwunlimited.net for the latest in pro wrestling news.